Hi guys, this month we're talking about how to tie a quick release knot. Now, firstly I want to say, I would never tie a horse to a portable round yard panel. We're using this to practice tying our knots. So you don't actually tie a horse. I don't have a horse here, I've just got a rope. So we're not actually tying the horse up. But it's easy to practice over something solid rather than the baling twine, which would be attached to a solid fence when we actually tie the horse up. So the first thing we do, so we take the tail end. So the tail end's the bit with the flapper on it or the end of the lead rope, the opposite end to the bit with the clip on it. So we take the tail end and we put it over the fence. And all we do is we grab the tail end like this and we just twist it like this. We grab the tail end, pull it underneath the rest of the rope, grab it and pull it through that loop and then we pull it up like this. And the reason we call it a quick release knot, this is the best part about a video as we can show you, if a horse was to get into any sort of trouble and we needed to undo the knot quickly, all we have to do is pull and the whole thing comes undone. So I'm going to show you how to do that through baling twine. It's better to practice on something solid, but then you need to practice through your baling twine. So you have a loop of baling twine, put the tail end through, baling twine, grab the tail end, twist, put the tail end under and pull it through. And then we grab, to, to tighten it up you grab the other end, the right end with the clip on it and push. And the reason it's a quick release knot is because we only have to pull it and the knot's undone. Next week we'll be talking about how to tie a rope halter correctly.